Witam w 87 odcinku z Red Dead Redemption 2 Lecimy dalej Kolejna misja Dacza Już nie mam kolejnych misji Możecie zobaczyć Są ewentualnie jakieś misje z pytajnikami Może gdzieś są Ale nie wiem gdzie No i najprawdopodobniej jest pizdu misji znajdźkowej Czyli że muszę znaleźć 100 części statku do UFO Chyba akurat w GTA nie tutaj, ale wiecie co Czyli się rozumiemy, nie? Well, at least you ain't run off. What you talking about? Pearson left. Old uncle. The traitors. Both gone at dawn. They said to young Tilly they were running to save themselves. I think Mary Beth left as well. So it goes. They are goddamn cowards. Arthur, cowards. Of all the time we spent. To run off? Well, I guess they don't want to die, Dutch. Ain't nobody gonna... <coughs> This is a tough time. And you ain't, you ain't doing too well. But we, our community, we will survive. They will not crush us. I hope so. But if we let Jack... And the women free. Well, then There maybe ain't we no can freedom for no one in this country no more, Arthur. One more big score. We got enough money to leave. All this turmoil has the army and Pinkerton spinning. We take a boat and slip away. I don't know what you're saying, Dutch, but it seems like I've heard it all before. Just one more. And I've always a goddamn train. Arthur, <coughs> this is different. We know. This is full of cash. Army payroll, money and supplies to repair the bridge that you blew. This is all going to plan. We rob Uncle Sam and we leave. <laughs> the poetry of it all. What do you think? It sounds wonderful. Hell, yeah. I ain't got much to lose, but... You know, the women and the children. And John and, and his family. I'm afraid I have to insist. I mean, we gotta let them go, because if the Pinkertons come through again, they will kill everyone. John? Insist? Yeah. Insist. Of course, pal. Whatever you... Think is best. I will see to it. Huh? Now, are we gonna rob a train? Sure. We will survive. We will flourish. We have work to do, my friends. Let's go. Come on. We are gonna borrow a little money from old Uncle Sam and be out of his hair once and for all. He insists. Let's ride out, gentlemen. Let's go. Yeah. Hey, you wish. Come on. It's this 
best way. I hid the wagon down here after we blew the bridge. This is one big goddamn group of us to be riding back into San Denis. Yeah, I heard the Pinkertons have pretty much taken over Van Horn. Moved a whole heap of men in there. Things are closing in fast. Shit. Nice. Pierdalać się prosto w mrowisko, nie? Should be just through these trees. There it is. I'll get the dynamite. No, I can do it. You sure? I'm fine. Look out! Okay, to the back. Mick. To tak wóz w środku tego lasu i nikt. Nie ten, każdy ma w dupie. Got it. All right. Let's get this done. So listen. Abigail just told me. The money? It's hidden in the caves at Beaver Hollow. What? Yeah. So much for never hiding it near camp. Dutch was getting even sloppier than we thought. Mm -hmm. Abigail and Jack ready to leave? I think so. Okay. Whatever happens with this job today, <laughs> wherever Dutch and them go next, we're getting you the hell out of here. We're going to get you the money you need. Knowing the three of you got out, well, maybe all of this will still mean something. <laughs> Tilly and Susan, too. I'll do whatever it takes. You've always had my back, Arthur. Well, uh, perhaps not always. Anyway, hmm. here we go. One last train, Arthur. One Stop the bus train. train. Zupełnie nie podejrzane, że grupa lat dziesięciu wyglądających na kowbojów ludzi jedzie przez środek miasta, ale totalnie nie podejrzane. Normalne wręcz, nie? Dzień jak co dzień na dzikim zachodzie. Już w sumie nie takim dzikim. Sadie, you board halfway along. John, you and Arthur are gonna board at the back. Rest of you, follow Mike and I, and join once they stop the train. Here she comes. Should I just sneak on now? 
God damn it. Well, everybody mount up. We're still going through with this. Of course we are. So good. No, that's. Tak się właśnie zatrzymali. Wybicie. Get 
get off the goat. We need to go for the money. Come on! The money should be in the front carriage. Let's go. Hey, quick. Blow our home. Let's go! The money's in their carriage. Now that the monster says, Oh, we're alive, yeah, just about. <coughs> well, let's move. Good work is custom stonks. Yeah. Where's John? I tried, I tried. He didn't make it. That patrol killed him. We had to run. Come on, let's go. Before another patrol turns up. Spoiler. On przeżywa w jedynce. Tyle wiem. No mi się kiedyś TikTok pojawił z tym. Że on jest w jedynce i jest przebitka na, na ten właśnie, na ten, na tą misję. No właśnie w jedynce mówi, że oni go zostawili, więc on zostawił ich. To tak. Tak, ja bym też był ciekawy. Trochę w śmierci od pieniędzy. Red Dead Redemption. Mam no, angielski. Sorry to hear that. We gotta let her go. John's a... Well, sorry, son. Without John, she's just bait. Got a bunch of money, Dutch. She's just a girl. They won't do nothing to her. But me and the boys know. Yep. We need to keep riding on this one, Dutch. You know it. Every man here knows so we it. we just gonna let the boy be made an orphan? It, it ain't like that. What is it like? I wanna live, cowpoke. I still got the choice, Dutch. It's just a girl. You're right. Dutch, Micah. Uh, it pains me to say it, Arthur. But he's right. Dutch! Come on, boys. Yeah! Well, I guess that's that then. All them goddamn years. Come on, Arthur. Let's go get her. You and me is all we need. Miss Tilly. Here. Take this. <clears throat> you take this money, too. Take Jack, and you wait at Copperhead Landing for Abigail and Mrs. Adler. Thank you, Arthur. You're a good girl. You live a good life now, you hear? All right, Arthur. I'll... I'll miss... Me too, sweetheart. Me too. Jack, come here. Be brave, son. I'm gonna go get your mama. Mrs. Adler, ride with me. If they're putting her on a boat, they'll probably dock at the north end of town. So I reckon we should go in the other way. Sure, I guess. I don't know. God, those goddamn bastards. Look, just follow me, okay? We're gonna get this done, Arthur. He don't care if the orphan's his friend's child so long as he gets rich. 
All this goddamn talk all them years. Seems like it was always a lie. Before he went crazy. What a mess. Sure. Guess he began to believe he was God or something. I don't know. I'm sorry you got dragged into this. Into us. Listen, if you hadn't shown up in my house that night, I'd be dead. And even this bullshit beats dead. I thought I could find a way to get John, Abigail, and Jack out of this mess. Give them a life. Seems I left it too late. If we could still get Abigail, maybe her and Jack will be okay. John, Hosea, Mac, Avi, Jenny, Sean, Lenny. We have to put an end to this. <coughs> and Eagle Flies, another angry fool he used just like he did with the rest of us. Like I said, Arthur, we don't need them. We're gonna make this right, me and you together. What's left of it? Now come on. Ditch the horses and come up with a plan. How you feeling? I'm okay. I think you should cover me and I'll go in there and get her. Cause you're the better shot, I mean. That ain't what you mean. I can still fight. I know, Arthur. But just do it my way, honey. It's for the best. Get up someplace high, like the lighthouse or something. And cover me. Please. Hmm. Okay. No. Get. Tam na plaży byli, no dobra. Sejdi, nie żyje. Chcę, no, chujowa mi się z tej snajperki strzela, no powiem wam tak. 
nie będę was oszukiwał, nie? Tym bardziej, że tu nie da się odzumować. Ja bym wolał na mniejszym przybliżeniu, bo chuja tu widzę, szczerze mówiąc. Kurde, no nie mogę strzelić, halo. Okay, Mr. Milton. I guess we're gonna have to talk this out like gentlemen. Teraz my idziemy to zobaczyć. down, Mr. Morgan. That's quite a cough. Sure. Tuberculosis. I'll be dead soon. And you with me, Mr. Milton? You'll be dead, sure. But I'm gonna be just fine. We offered you a deal, Mr. Morgan. You should have taken it. I'm a fool, Mr. Milton. Not all you boys have quite so many scruples. Old Micah Bell? Micah? You mean Molly? Molly O'Shea? Sweated her a couple of times, never talked a word, had to let her go. 
Micah Bell. We picked him up when you boys came back from the Caribbean. And he's been a good boy ever since. So it's like, oh yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Using your strength, Mr. Morgan. You're still a yapping dog, Mr. Milton. No. Oh. Horrible man. <laughs> now come on, both of you. Damn. Yeah,